Hey everybody, Jeff here and welcome back to another video. Today we've got some great tool deals here for you that I wanted to tell you about. And first I got to apologize. I knew about this one here with the Ryobi hack uh, a couple of days ago, but it was just so busy the other day dealing with helping out some uh, widows and elderly ladies that we know that needed uh, desperate help. So I just didn't have enough time to get down to getting this out to you. But at least, you know, it's good until the end of the month. So I wanted to show you folks about this because the Ryobi hack is back. So it's time for the Ryobi hack attack. And by the way, a special shout out goes out to Stan the Man for alerting me to this a couple of days ago that the Ryobi hack attack is back here at Home Depot. So when you go to Home Depot, you just type in Ryobi here and into your search with nothing else. And what we're going to show you here is some really cool hacks. It's, it's basically very similar to what they had uh, before, where if you put this charger with these two 3.0 amp hour batteries into your shopping cart and then stick a couple of other tools in there, it will save you buku amounts of money on both of them. So let's take a look at that right now. Okay, so let us continue the Ryobi hack attack here. We're going to get to this Ryobi battery charger here and we'll add it to the cart. Now, this right now is showing up as $99. And as you know, when the sale went off after Black Friday, the price had gone back up to $150. But then they dropped it to $99 again immediately. This is like the old Ryobi days sale that we had last summer. Very similar. This is the same similar kit here. All right, so anyway, it's showing up as $99 in our cart. And the way this Ryobi hack works is there's five brushless tools that if you choose one of these brushless tools and stick it in the cart along with this, you'll see some massive reductions in price go on here. All right, so let's continue shopping here. And let's try the Ryobi, and we're looking for brushless. So I'm going to type up here in the search here, brushless recip rotating saw. Let's try that one. See if that comes up with anything. Okay, so here's the saw right here. And tool only by itself is $129 for this saw. So we're going to click here the add to cart button. And it gets into the cart there and let's go and view our cart. We'll click on the view cart button right here. And you can see what it did. It dropped the price over here to 5601 for the uh, the charger kit with the two batteries, and it dropped the price of the reciprocating saw here down to 7299. So I mean, where else can you get a brushless sawzall type of tool here for that price here? Much much less getting these two batteries there for that price. So that's a pretty stellar deal here. Okay, so here's the core of it. Here's how you determine what is going on here. So if you look over here, it says you saved 54% off. And these are the items right here that it's talking about. You see where we've got it highlighted here? These are the part numbers. These are the one, two, three, four, five brushless part numbers here from Ryobi that are part of this deal here. So it basically says if you purchase one of these tools, you're getting a free one lithium HP 3.0 battery two pack starter kit with the charger bag applied. So that's how this deal is working. So you can see here that your subtotal here would have been $278 and they took off $149. And if you do this online and just do it with shipping, they'll ship it for free or you can go down to the store and get it. Okay, so let's go ahead and remove this guy out of there okay so now we're we've got just the the battery still in there and you can see the price goes back to $99 so now I'm going to go ahead and grab let's do search for the circular saw so there's the circular saw right here So it's this one here, the $119 one, tool only. Let's click on this one here and let's add it to the cart. So 
So now when we go and look at our cart, let's click on the view cart link there, and we go inside and look, you can see again it dropped the price of the charger with the batteries here down to $54, and here is the circular saw. It basically dropped in, in half there down to $64. And now again they're telling us our subtotal would have been $268 over here in the upper right, and that it saved us $149. So there is your second deal. Okay, so let's remove that from the shopping cart here. Let us now go back up here and search uh, for, uh, let's go Ryobi Brushless Impact. Let's see what we got. So here's the impact driver for $99 right here and we're going to add it to the cart or as they said in the Super Bowl ad we add it to the cat to your cat let's do one and let's go it's added it into the cart now and we go to view the cart and you can see the cost of that impact driver just dropped down to 50 bucks right there see that and of course the charger drops back down also to 49.52 uh, so half of half of the price there so essentially you're getting quite the deal there i mean where else can you get a brushless impact driver for 50 bucks now i know some of the people out there are going to say hey this isn't as good as dewalt you know people shouldn't be using this well hey for your average diyer and homeowner to get a brushless drill this cheap heck yeah I'm I'm still contemplating getting this just to have another cheap impact driver to throw in my trunk as a lifeboat in case I'm caught somewhere where, I, where I'm in between uh, three or four places that I visit in a day and I forget to bring a drill with me or something, you know. And then I'd have two more of these because I I use like the Ryobi blowers and okay. So now let's remove the impact driver. Let's go back up and do our search here, and we're going to search for the jigsaw, the Ryobi brushless jigsaw. So there's your jigsaw. It's the only search result there. And let's go ahead and add this to our cart. <coughs> and let's let's view our cart here. And when we get there, we can see again it dropped the price of the the charger down to fifty six oh one right here. You can see it highlighted there, and but look what it did to the sawzall, seventy two bucks. Now I'm actually seriously thinking about getting this deal because I don't believe it or not I don't own a jigsaw. I just don't use one that often, like maybe once or twice a year, and it's usually somebody with me has one. So, but. This would be a great deal to get one real cheap for that price for seventy two ninety nine. So yeah, I'm pretty much thinking of scoring this deal right here with the jigsaw. So anyway, so there's that one, and let's go ahead and remove him from the cart, and let's go back and try the final one here, which is the angle grinder. So Ryobi brushless grinder let's try that see if that comes up with anything All right so there's the grinder it's $99 tool only and if we add it to the cart and let's go view the cart so you can see here again it dropped our charger down to 49.50 and it's weird how the charger keeps kind of bouncing around between the 40s and the 50s but I think that's because they're they're trying to give you the charger free while averaging down the price of the the tool so they just make it mix and match there but anyway so now the this grinder just dropped down to $49 for a brushless grinder and, and um, you know people can knock Ryobi but I can tell you I have a Ryobi angle grinder that I bought in 2016 and that thing still kicks butt to this day. It is still an unbelievable. In fact, I think I bought it in 2015, rather. So I've been using it for five years on grinding concrete floors. We've ground down tile that we've pulled up, an old thin set, and with a grinding cup on here. And I can tell you this thing just 
has totally done really great. Uh, not the cordless one, though. I, I have the corded version of this. Uh, but it's just, just a decent tool that I have no complaints about whatsoever. So let me do an experiment here. I want to go back and add one of the others to the cart and see if I can do multiple tools in here. So let's go back to the Ryobi brushless impact driver here. And if I add this guy to the cart, to your cart, you're adding it to the cart. Let's go now and, hey, I don't think it added, add. Take one from there, add it to the cart. Now there's three items in the cart and let us view the cart. And let's see if it kept any deals going there. Yeah, it did. I think only on one of them. So that's the way it works here. So here's the charger here at $49. It kept the impact driver at 99 and it gave us the deal here on the grinder. And I believe that's because Whichever one was in first got the deal. So whichever tool you wanted to actually get the deal on, they're probably all the same. I don't know. But that's how it works. So if you wanted to keep buying more batteries and, and getting more, uh, more deals, you could do them as separate deals altogether. So there you have it on the Ryobi deals. This is the, the Ryobi hack attack here. Okay, so now let's go take a look at the other deal in BBR2. Thanks to BBR2 for alerting us to this one here the other day. Big shout out to BBR2. So this one here is the Milwaukee M12. So this is your lithium ion uh, cordless 3 8 inch impact wrench here. And this also comes with an inflator combo kit and also a 3 8 inch drive metric socket set. So it's this, uh, I think it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, I think it's like 13 piece or something like that. Anyway, so here is, it's a special buy on this particular one here because you can see over here that normally you're going to spend $279 on this kit. So they've taken $130 off of this, oh, about 47% off. So it's down to $149. We don't know how long this is going to last. We know the Ryobi deal is, is going to last until the end of February, as far as we can tell from what we've heard. But if you're kind of starting out and doing some work on your, your car, this is a, a great kit to get here because it's got the, you know, your impact socket wrench here and the inflator and, an, and a little kit. This is a great little emergency kit to keep in your car. It may not have all the sockets you'll need. It's not, it's certainly not like your, your Craftsman 216 piece kit that we reviewed or your DeWalt 173 piece kit that we reviewed for you when we did that tool review uh, about a month or so ago. But certainly this is a good deal. And then another thing too is if you go back to your uh, main page here on Home Depot, actually you can get to it from any, you go up here, see where this up here in the upper here where it says local ad and you click on the local ad that's where you find out what's actually going on so the the new ad started yesterday and it's actually been really bland the last few weeks guys no tools at all in there finally we started to see a few things here okay so really the only thing for tools that we're seeing this week is this here from milwaukee but um some of these prices really don't look any different here so here you you got here the um the m12 you got a six amp hour and a three amp hour battery for 99 dollars i'm not sure if i ever even really saw it at the original 168 here this other battery pack here you get the m18 a six amp and a three amp hour 149 and I'm pretty sure we saw that at that price at, at during Black Friday. Um, the stud here did come down at 1397. I don't recall seeing it when I was in Home Depot yesterday though. I saw some of these other ones that were in the 20s. And here they're showing the pack out. So you got to be careful. It says, you know, local ad. You would think, well, this is in the ad. It's got to be on sale. This is not on sale. This is the normal price for a pack out right here. 279 these were down to 199 I think at uh, Black Friday and if you were smart and went to places like International Tool I think during Black Friday you could have gotten this as low as 179 or something somewhere around that area if I recall correctly 
So just be careful when you see these. Not everything in the ad is on sale, right? So there is a deal of the day going on here that I wanted to show you about. So we're going to come down here and a special buy of the day. And it's pretty much this one, but I, I just can't remember because there were so many Husky benches. I can't remember which one it was or how much we saw it for before. So they've got this one here. Let's take a look at it. So it says that, that the special buy price is 227 and it was 379 before, so you're getting 40% off. Now, I don't know how how much of a discount that is. Normally, when it's a really good price, you'll, you'll see they have a counter going right here that's counting down. But we don't see that here right now, anyway. So these are some of the deals I wanted to just let you know about. And then also, folks, um, let me show you what we're working on today. I'm hoping to get this video released tomorrow. So we are compiling as we speak. You can see the software here compiling my video here that we're hoping to launch tomorrow night at 8.30 or so as a premiere. So this is a repair we had to do at my friend's house where we were tasked with having to extract out the kitchen base cabinet under the sink, pull it all the way out under un underneath the granite countertop without destroying the granite countertop. And I'll, I'll show you here just a real quick uh, view here. This is one of the scenes here. So it was about five hours of work here where we had to pull completely every single thing out, every screw out, every valve, and even the sink. And that's how we extracted it out of there. So that's just a quick scene that I'll, I'll show you from this. So that will premiere tomorrow night. And then also, if you go to our main video page here and you click on videos you'll want to check out some of the the videos we've launched recently like the other day we did this the live stream from outside Costco showing the hundred and thirty dollars off the Dyson V11 vacuum which we're going to do a tool review on hopefully in the coming week and then here this is another project we started this week with another friend of mine here where we've already ripped out this entire kitchen the other day so we're putting in all new cabinets we're showing you how we're remodeling that kitchen and this was a really good one here this plumbing tips video we put up earlier in the week on alternatives to using the saddle valve here so that uh, you don't you don't run a r the risk of running against the, the plumbing codes and cause yourself thousands of dollars in damage here so make sure you come and check out some of these videos that we've uploaded over the past several weeks here we've got some really good stuff here here we 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 tested a bunch of vacuum cleaners against each other to see which one had the best suction. Over here we showed you how to install Schluter Ditra. Here we showed you how to install a Wi-Fi thermostat here. We did all sorts of other tool reviews and repairs here in, in the previous weeks here. So make sure you check those out. So anyway, thanks for tuning in on this update here today. And we hope to see you tomorrow night at 8.30 for the premiere of our video on how to remove and reinstall a new kitchen sink cabinet. That's it for this one, folks. Thank you for joining us, and we'll see you on the next one.